Welcome to Success Journey. Today in this video, we will going to discuss T and PSC Engineering Service Examination 2022. So, what can be the expected cutoff for Civil Engineering branch that we will discuss today. Before moving ahead, I would like to request you, if you like the video, please like the video and subscribe to the channel. Let's move ahead and see what can be the expected cutoff. First of all, we will discuss exam details. We know that the advertisement number is 613, notification number is 10. Out of the total vacancy, 570, approximate 578 vacancy was for the civil engineering. It, the number may vary a little bit, but overall you can just add it on. First of all, the 66 vacancy is for civil engineering. Next, this vacancy is for civil engineering, this vacancy is for civil engineering, this is for civil engineering and these two vacancies for civil engineering. So once we will add it on, it will approximate equal to 578 vacancy. But it may vary uh, one or two vacancy depending upon your calculation, okay? Now question paper difficulty. So as per my opinion, the paper difficulty was moderate level and total marks was not 120, rather it was 450 marks. It was written by mistake. So it was 450 marks from that the cutoff will be decided. We will discuss it on next slide also. Scheme of the examination that we can see here, 300 marks from the subject or the discipline. This 150 marks was only for the qualifying purpose, that means language paper. And this 150 marks was for the evaluation. So that means from paper one, this 300 marks and from paper two, part B will be only used to evaluate the final cutoff for the written exam. So it is also mentioned here that this part is only for the qualifying purpose. That means 40% of the marks is mandatory, right? Now, once we will add it on, that means out of 450 marks and the final cutoff, the final cutoff will also be based on the 40% and 30%. That means for these category, the cutoff, minimum cutoff will be 30%. That means 30% of 450 plus 60 and 40% of this marks 450 plus 60 marks right so this will be the also minimum required cutoff after interview also right so now we will see what can be the expected cutoff and we will also see what are the previous cutoff trends in the previous year so in the, pre in the 2019 years total vacancy was approximated 415 again I am saying that number of vacancy may vary depending upon your calculation so do not argue about that I am just taking for the reference and the cutoff was for the general category was approximate 228 again in the year of 2018 the number of vacancy was less and the cutoff was high it was 335 now in this year total number of vacancy is quite high 578 vacancy so the number of vacancy is quite high so cutoff will remain little bit lower but here I have pointed out little bit higher cutoff so that competition can also be encountered, right? So for the general category, approximated, again remember it, this is the, this is the upper range. So cutoff will not go beyond this level. It may remain up to 300 marks, but in worst case, it may go up to 330. Similarly for female, it may remain up to 20, 320. For the BC category as well, SC and ST category as well, I have just written here you can see here just remember this is only my opinion cutoff may not be in this range but this is the higher or the upper range of the cutoff if your marks are more than this you can be consider you can consider yourself in the safer zone and prepare for the interview this was from my end thanks for watching the video if you like the video please like the video and subscribe to the channel thank you all see you in the next video